Do you know if coconut milk is better than almond milk and oat milk for blood sugar levels? I have a continuous glucose monitor and let's find out. So far, whole milk has been the king with only a 7 mg spike and the oat milk has been worst with a 41 mg spike. So how does coconut milk compare to the milks I've tried so far? So today I'm having 300 ml of coconut milk. It has 0 grams of protein, 6 grams of fat, 9 grams of added sugar and 88 calories. On numbers, it seems terrible because it has no protein and has added sugar. I have to say coconut milk was the tastiest milk I've tried so far. Let's see what my glucose monitor shows. Wow, a 30 mg spike? From next time, I'll be cautious buying coconut milk because of three reasons. First, it has large spikes, which I don't want at all. And it has no protein, so it is not adding anything essential to your diet. And finally, it has 6 grams of fat. There are two kinds of fats. Saturated fats, which are bad for you. And second are unsaturated fats, which are good for you. Out of the 6 grams of fat in coconut milk, 5 grams is saturated fats only. So it mostly has fat, which is not good for you. And once again, So Delicious also makes an unsweetened version of the coconut milk. I challenge So Delicious brand to take out this product from the market and only have the unsweetened ones for the better of the society. So that's why coconut milk is not so great for blood sugar levels.